Welcome you guys to the first episode of Minecraft Single Player Survival. Anyways, today we are starting our adventure like every other Minecrafter and that is by playing some single player. I've actually been anticipating doing this series for quite a while, but to quickly answer a question that some of you guys may be wondering about is, Jay, your hunger bar is down. Well, I have a simple explanation for that and that is that this recording has failed multiple times and I've tried resetting the world to where I would be perfectly fine because I love this world in particular. I actually spawned on this tree at the very beginning and I saw this tree. I did 360. I was like, yeah, that's my tree right there because, oh, well, this is my world. And it just so happened every time, like 1.9 doesn't like my computer. But as mentioned just now, I am playing on Minecraft 1.9. So it should be a pretty fun adventure. And let's just get right into it. But I've tried recreating the world multiple times and let, let's just say every time I did, it didn't have the big trees. It wouldn't be like how it was. And I kind of want to keep that tree because it's kind of iconic to me in a sense, just because how it's like laid out and just how it's strange looking to begin with. But let's see. So this is actually, as I mentioned earlier, a series that I've been anticipating for for quite a while now. And yeah, so... Let's see, gotta quickly do that real quickly. But at the very end of December, it was a series I was kind of looking forward to. And I was like, I, I know I'm going to do it, but now the question is when? And now it is. So every Wednesday, the idea is to be uploading an episode of this in particular. And then Mondays and Fridays, I shall be uploading Afterlife. But the real question is if I'm able to actually keep up to date with that. I mean, if I'm able to, then we may pump out more videos, but I don't really want to push myself to the limit on these things as that is not something I want to do and burn myself out because I am one to be burned out really quickly. And let's see. So we already have this on hard for you guys. So you already know. And then to quickly prove to you guys that I cannot go in game mode right there. Boom. Uh, the seed will be released when we hit episode, what is it, 25. And then episode 50, we shall be releasing the actual first world download. So that's quite a ways away. But I feel like it's for the best with things, in my opinion. I feel like we shouldn't be really, like, I don't know. I feel like giving away the world is kind of like a sacred thing. Because even if you have the seed, I don't think you're able to, like, to recreate the actual spawn area, like, with these trees. Because... I tried recreating this world like 10 times with those trees, like the big trees right there, and it would not happen. It's like, what in the world is happening? So yeah, I had fun trying to get this world, but that did not happen. And we need to hurry up and kill some sheep. And also, just to have a little fun conversation with you guys, we are playing on 1.9. And this is actually my first time like having a real experience playing it. And the idea right now is that we're going to be killing sheep because they are not something we really need at the moment. And I feel like they're the best thing to prey upon. However, right now we seem to be struggling. I was trying to get a last sheep, but that doesn't seem to be happening. Just, just die. Come on, make it simple. And I don't think we're going to really have an easy day. This is going to be really difficult right off the bat, you guys. First, Jay messes up the recordings like 10 times, and now we already have to go down under. Oh, this is going to be really interesting. I already can tell you guys that much. But we should probably uh, plug this up real quick. And I think we're going to start digging down right now because that is the best option we have. And I really don't want to keep you guys waiting on things, but we're going to make a quick cubby hole right here and make ourselves a furnace. That way we can start chugging down some food. And then, oh my gosh, I just realized this is going to be my first night in Minecraft and it's going to be difficult. I can tell you that much. I want to cut down some trees real quickly though, because I do not want to have the experience of getting stuck down there like caving without any food as that would be really tragic. So the idea is to release this every Wednesday, if I didn't say that, well, I am I did, but this has actually been on my Google Calendar, so like it reminds me every Wednesday at like 4 or 4.30 that this series, like th a video for the series came out, and it's the saddest thing ever. It's like a reminder that I should be doing it, and I've actually had the guts now to do it, 
so it should be fulfilling another series i do have other series playing on the channel for this but oh well, other series on the channel playing out but right now this is currently what we're doing oh my gosh come on oh it cooked man that didn't take a while at all man i feel like my frames are jittery like it's high for a second and then it jumps down real quickly i don't know let's see so the idea right now is to quickly get some food because we are struggling i know we're spending quite a bit of time trying to get some food oh oh i actually want to keep you a librarian um how, how do i go about this Ooh, an apple yeah i want to keep them can i make a shovel real quick let's see um no we don't even have anything can I quickly just get this? Because I want to dig them down. Because the librarian villagers would be nice right about now. But I think I'm getting really off topic with you guys. Like, we're struggling with food and all that right off the bat. And, like, I don't want to, like, start skipping out on content with you guys. Come on, get down. Okay, that works. And then, do you have a block in your hand? No, you don't. You want to pick that up? You going to pick that up? Bro, come on. Can you just pick something up? I mean, I'm trying to keep you right here. Okay, well, we're just going to leave him right there. And let's see. I don't really want to kill the pigs, though. That's that's really disappointing if I have to resort to that. Oh, and there's some mobs over here, too. So I'm going to quickly abandon you guys for a second. Well, that seems really bad, but we have to do that because we need some food. And this is currently the struggle, so... Yeah, be right back, you guys. Okay, you guys, so we're back now. Anyways, we're going to start digging down now because we have a little bit of food. There's not a whole lot of animals for us to kill around here, and I kind of want to kill all the animals that I see in sight. So I think the idea right now is to start digging down a whole bunch and hopefully find a potential cave while there is nighttime still occurring. And it's quite the experience, uh, well, scary experience right now because... I am not really used to the whole idea of, oh, you have to wait for your uh, attack to load. And it's kind of a pain in the butt in a sense too, in my opinion. So yeah, I think the best idea for right now is to avoid mobs because I don't want to obtain my first death anytime soon. And then the, one of the big things I wanted to tell you guys is that this first episode is not really going to be a big game-changing episode for the series. It's just kind of the introduction Then we're going to be mining for basically the whole period and just chatting about next episode we should be building a house if not some other ideas maybe farms getting that show on the road for us because that is something that we need to prioritize on because food is one of the biggest pains in the butt believe it or not and that is something we should be worrying about because right now i never really realized that food is quite the thing to struggle with right now and like i don't know like i didn't really think it was that big of a deal but like I think like playing on a new world once again kind of reminded me that Minecraft's not really that simple at the very beginning. It's kind of a bit of the struggle with like hunger and all that. But then once you get the hunger situation kind of settled, everything's a bit easy. Like basically it becomes like, oh, easy food done. Oh, you're basically going to get armor really easily because eventually I'll find some iron down here. And then we already found some coal. So that's pretty nice. Oh, and I just noticed my game is really up high for you guys. So I don't even need torches to mine down. This is pretty nice. But I think we're going to stop on the coal right there. We don't really need to continue on it, in my opinion. I just want some iron. That way we can get geared up. I don't even know how to make a, a shield yet. I think that's where you put leather in the middle and maybe sticks all around it. No, that's an item frame. What am I thinking? Well... Ooh, lapis. So, this, you guys, is one of the most valuable blocks in the game. You, while you may mock me for this, I've learned my lesson on always to collect lapis. Because, hey, it's great for enchanting. And then it's also a wonderful building block when you need it. So, big piece of advice right there. Because, oh, I thought that was diamonds for a second. Like, I swear I saw it. But, like, that is something I've learned. Something we all need to do in life. Collect lapis while it may be fake. No. Can I get it back, please? I like having my first tools. Uh, maybe, well, we can just make one down here, I guess. It's really sad. I like keeping all my first tools. 
And let's see, put you right here. We already have sticks all the way up there. We probably should have went up there. That way we could get the rest of the food just in case. But we seem like we're kind of settled on things. Why am I finally getting my achievements? I don't know. Did I mess something up? I'm a bit nervous now. And we have to keep going right now. Can we just find like a cave or some iron or diamonds? Because we're getting really deep down here. And I don't like the idea of strip mining for the first episode. Because that's really boring for you guys in my opinion anyways. And let's see. Do we? Are we we're getting really close down here. I don't think I hear any lava either. So that is not a fun little task for us. As we have to find something to keep us entertained with. And the idea is to at least find some diamonds in the first episode. And let's see. Anything yet? No, maybe I'll turn up my game sounds. That way we can hear a bit better. Because, I mean, I did turn them down a bit earlier. But we have to raise them up. That way we can hear if there's any lava nearby. Or potential water or mobs. Oh, and then finding some actual like mob spawners nearby would be pretty nice. Oh, what was that? Some block lag? We're not even playing on a server either. But let's continue on anyways, you guys. Hopefully we'll find something eventually. Because this is quite the show. <laughs> and let's see. So, what are some of the big things in 1.9 that we have to worry about? Well, I can tell you guys something about the spawn. So we have awesome little trees at the spawn. We, have, we spawned in a forest by them. And then we have some mountains to the north or well uh to the west actually i did hear some lava just then is it up maybe it's the side we'll see we'll move over this way and try to tell uh it seems to be getting a tiny bit louder um it's getting really loud actually now where might it be? Is it up above? Might be below us. Man, I really hate this goose chase. Okay, we gotta raise it up. Okay, we're gonna just continue this way then. Where did it go? Come on. Keep going, please. I really wouldn't mind finding a cave right now. It would be the really great thing right now. I don't know. I'm about to give up on it. This is just not turning out to the greatest caving experience ever. Unlike most people, usually people tend to have good caving experiences on their first day. And this is not the good thing at all. Which is quite worrying for me. I feel like I'm deaf if I can't find this. Is it over here? Seems to be getting louder. Is it above me? That is the question. No. We still haven't even found any iron and we've been digging around for quite a bit. I don't know. This is not the good thing for me. Can we just find something? I think we're getting really close. It might be below us now. Or maybe to the side. Wait, iron! We finally found something of use! Now this is what I'm talking about, you guys. We finally got something of value. Something that's worthwhile for us. I never found it this difficult to find some iron on the first day. Which is quite strange. Usually you'll find iron right off the bat. But this time we've had quite the struggle with it. Which is really shocking. Oh, we found some redstone. Uh, the idea is probably to avoid it for now. I don't really like redstone, besides that it provides XP. And that's really it. Can we find anything, though? I really want to find this lava. I don't know, I'm about to give up. We're just going to continue strip mining. I think that is the best bet for us. And then we're going to quickly make a furnace for ourselves. And then put it up here because we might as well and then smelt to that iron that way we can finally get a pickaxe or well, an iron pickaxe anyways in case if we find any diamonds because diamonds oh man 
That would be good. So let's see. What what are we doing? Like, so next episode, I think the idea is to build a farm. And then I'm currently going to be planning out all the next episodes after that. That way we're kind of settled on things and we don't have to worry about things to do. Follow would be nice if you guys want to recommend anything in the comment section below. That is a great thing. And then also, if you guys have any ideas, like, in ways to incorporate you guys into the series, you guys can also leave a comment down below with your answer in response to that question because i wouldn't mind because i don't want to do like an ethos style thing where you like take like ask a question put in or well he doesn't put a ask a question i think he just simply um takes the best comment or well the comment that he likes the most and then puts in the video or well, in a book anyways i don't want to do that i don't want to feel like i'm copying i mean we can do the simple tree where you put a sign on a tree and say that's your tree. But I don't want to do that either. Because I've seen a lot of YouTubers do it too. Even KS. I know he's done it. And I don't want to copy him. However he's not doing that for season 2 yet. So I don't want to do it anyway still. But yeah. So K that KS dude. He's a person in my sub box on the YouTube channel. And he is a Minecraft single player YouTuber. Just like I'm currently starting up. He's done it. Well he's currently on season 2. And he's doing a marvelous job. Whitefire, another single player YouTuber, he's currently doing, and like he's doing single player too, but he's also doing like, uh, I don't know, I don't know how to explain it, but man, we're still not finding a whole lot of stuff like no gold, no caves. This is really shocking. Like, okay, so now you want to show up. How did the lava not really pick up? That is really my question. Oh, and then one of the big things I just remember is that they re reworked how regen worked and how hunger sort of worked too. So this could be interesting. Oh, oh, is it opening up? It's opening up. Oh, yes. We, we found something, you guys. I like this. This, this is what we're talking about. I'm going to laugh if it's a dead end and then you guys just can mock me forever. But why is there block lag? Like, we're not on a server, so it doesn't really, it really seem logical for that to be happening. Oh, I so thought, do uh, like, lava just started the flow in for their second. Give me that. Give me some quick XP. Perhaps no lava down there. Thank you. Maybe there's a cave or something this way. Come on. Come on. You don't want to pop out? Oh, there we go. Maybe not. Over here. This is really disappointing. Like, you gotta give me something to chew on at least. Like, this is not a fun mining experience in my opinion. However, we're going to continue on our little strip mine adventure as we try to find something wonderful. So I think I'm gonna leave you guys here for a bit and come back when I found something good for you guys. But beer right back, you guys. Okay, you guys, so we're back now, and then we found something, I think. I've been hearing some skeletons, some lava, some water, and this is... Oh, no. Hello. Can we... Oh, gosh. Okay, that was really shocking. Man, and then this is my first time using the left arm thing, which is really scary. Okay, I didn't mean to place that, but okay. Let's break you real quickly. Hello, Mr. Skellington. I'm here to be your friend today. Please come visit me at 123 um, White House. I don't know. <laughs> Hello. Come on. And they made skeletons so much smarter too. How? How did you hit me? Tell me. That's all I want to know. How did you hit me? Like, no other skeleton that I know has been able to do that. But Redstone... I'll take you even though you're kind of pointless to me. And then we'll take some shrooms over here because that is a source of food. And we'll probably need that down the road just in case if we get stuck down here. Or we start dying and starving to death. Because you just have to be prepared you guys. That's all you have to be in life. Prepared. Prepared for the worst and the best. And let's see. So place you. 
are you really kidding me there's still nothing for us like there is literally no diamonds none of that it's like it's all a prank it's all a ruse so we're going to be right back again until we find something pretty good for us because right now this is really unsettling for me as i'm trying to provide you guys the best caving experience on the minecraft universe but be right back you guys Okay, you guys, last second here, we found a ravine, I think. This is what we've been looking for. We're quickly going to go back and get our stuff because I started smelting because our pick broke. And yeah, this is finally what we've been looking for. Like, I've been pulling my hair out just for this because of how pitiful this is. Because it's taking us forever just to actually get something. And like, it's really sad. I don't know. We're going to keep that smelting over there and just continue on with the trip here. And hopefully we'll find some goodies because right now I just see gold. I want to see some blue stuff, some diamonds. Come on now. Like, we've been on this adventure for quite a while. We haven't seen really anything worthwhile. And then this is our first sight of something great and marvelous. Uh, let's go over here. But man, look at all this gold. Gold galore. I mean, this would be perfect for a UHC, but that's not what we're doing. We're playing some normal Minecraft. Is there more gold? Oh, no, that's iron. What happens if we just found the strong gold right here and then? That would be pretty cool. And then we were able to loot it for all its good jewels in it. Because there are some chests in it anyways. And then, oh, we need to make a water bucket now I think about it. We need one of those. Place Um, we'll, we'll just place that there. Leave you be, and let's see, make you real quick. You're taking quite a while to, um, to cook, which is not good. I really need that to go faster, because I would like some protection. Oh, and yeah, they added water buckets. Oh, I thought I saw a mob up there going kamikaze on me. I was scared for my life right then and there. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, but okay. There's a skeleton over there keeping eye on us. And yeah, that's really, really scary to think about. But anyways, let's let's quickly transition over here. I love how I'm just thinking I'm like cool now and I can just like move around and all that. Some lapis up there, that's pretty good. Going to quickly settle this. Um, hello, fine sir, you want to come over here? I really wish I had like eggs or snowballs to throw at him. That would be nice. I'm going to eat this. Oh, you think you got the... Oh, oh. Ah! Run! Bonsai! No. Okay. We're good. Wait, is he dead? We're good. Let's just continue our adventure like nothing happened. You guys didn't hear like a little squeal or any of that. And let's just gather more gold. Where is the diamonds at? Like, I think this world just hates me. Like, I thought this world looked good at first, but like from the looks of it right now... Um, it's not looking real good for us. Ooh, a double ravine. Man, we're just getting deeper into this. Like, this is getting exciting. I don't even know why I'm switching blocks when we can just use our left hand. Then again, I'm a righty, so I guess that makes sense. Ooh, ooh, maybe, maybe some diamonds down there? How do, how do, there we go. It's so weird using another hand in Minecraft now. Oh, heck no. Just stay over there. Just please stay over there. I, I really don't like using this other hand. You can stay over there. I just want some diamonds. That's it. Is there any diamonds down here? Diamonds? Housekeeping! So we're still not able to find any diamonds. And this is really sad for me. Like, gold. Okay, gold. Cool. Where are the diamonds? I just want diamonds. That's it. Is there diamonds down over here, maybe? No? You gotta be kidding me. 
Like, there's not even a mob spawner or any of that. Just gold, 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 iron. Like, that's all I've seen, you guys. I think we're going to cut it right here now, you guys. I think we're actually just going to call it an episode two while we're at it. Hopefully, you guys, you enjoyed the first episode. Next episode, episode should be really better, in my opinion, as we're going to be doing building and all that fun jazz. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. My name is Jay, and I shall see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye, you guys.